Hey everybody, welcome to Post to Post, it's Neil here. We just talked about the Washington Capitol Stadium Series jersey. If you haven't seen the video, go check it out. We'd love to, for you to hear my opinion, and more importantly, give your opinion down below in the comment section on that video. But in this one, we gotta talk Carolina Hurricanes, because although this is a new jersey, we've kind of already seen it before. If you've been following jerseys very intensely for the past year or more, you will have already seen this jersey because it was it was sneakily kind of not released but not sold but you could buy it but you could get it but you couldn't but it was it was out there and some people actually got it so we've we've already or I've already given my opinions on the jersey itself I'm, I'm more interested to talk about the uniform because I think the uniform is there's great things about this uniform but there's maybe some not so great things about this uniform. Let's take, bring up some photos and let's take a peek. So the first photo we have here is maybe the best photo that we're gonna look at today. This is straight from the Carolina Hurricanes. We can see everything except for the skates essentially and that doesn't really matter. So we've got uh, the jersey. Let's quickly talk, recap on the jersey. Beautiful jersey, absolutely beautiful jersey. I love this. The fact that the red sits right here and holds the number. I just I think the black numbers look so good on that. It just stands out so well. The nice little uh, kind of uh, charcoal gray with some texture in, in the striping down below. And then just the, the logo kind of recolorized like that. It looks so good. Like I really, really, really like this jersey. I think they nailed it here with this one. Now the uniform itself, the jersey bleeds down into the gloves perfectly. I like that. The transition from black to red to gray to black and then down into the black pants perfect transition there and then at the bottom of the pants we go black down into black in the socks and then red and then charcoal gray they stick the flow of this uniform is pretty much perfect but there's one thing i didn't mention it's the helmet now the helmet's black but as you can see there are some markings on the helmet so let's move on to the next photo actually and let's peek that a little bit closer uh, that looks like a number to me i'm pretty sure it is a number and it's huge it is huge it's it's too big i think it's it's so big it's distracting and I know that you know this is stadium series they like to push the boundaries and that's what it's all about but to me it's you're putting bright red on black it's going to stand out so much I just think it's it's too much for me personally I like like in fact I would say not even like this entire uniform other than the helmet I think is perfect like I just absolutely hit a home run but the helmet completely loses me. I do not like the helmet. Let's move on to the next image where it gets even better than just the uniform itself. It's the pants and it is the warning flag on the side. I know a lot of people collect jerseys. Does anyone collect pants? Because I feel like this would be on the list for someone to collect and they're not even pants, they're technically shorts, but uh, you know, that's a conversation for another time. But just a wonderful decision to put these on the pants. Uh, I, I absolutely love it. Man, this is just such a great uniform. Uh, going on to the patch, a close up shot of the patch here. Now we've already seen this logo. We've kind of talked about it a little bit. I think it's in previous videos, but uh, I think it's, it's very nice, but it's not a standout stadium series patch or logo or emblem or whatever. It's gonna be one that fades into the background. Not a lot of people gonna remember this uh, this emblem, which is, it's fine. It's just a, you know, it's just a logo. Let's go back to the original photo. Look at the uniform in whole once again. So like I said, uniform is basically perfect. Um, other than the helmet, I think, uh, you know, the transition, the flow, the colorization, the color balance, the recolorization of logos, everything that they've done here is, I think they've just done a wonderful job. I think this is going to look great on the ice. It's going to look great matched up against the Washington Capitals one. And um, I'm pretty excited actually to see uh, actual photos of this on the ice during the game. I think it's going to be great. So um, I don't want to rate this at a 10 because the, the jersey has such a different rating than uh, the uniform. Uh, you know, the jersey itself is... Uh, I don't even know. I can't do it because the helmet just, the helmet just ruins it a little bit for me. So I'm not going to give any rating. I'm just going to, I just said what I've already want to say, basically. So uh, now I would love to hear what you want to say down below in the comment section. If you've got a couple of minutes, go down and please leave your opinion. Uh, I read all the comments and I'd love to know your opinion on this one and the Washington one. Um, there's, there's more videos to come as well. I got to talk about the new Carolina, uh, the new uh, Arizona Coyotes jersey. We talked about the leak, but we haven't talked about the official photos yet and the actual release. So that's coming. Uh, we're talking jersey concepts as well pretty soon. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to release this video on Thursday tonight as I'm filming it or Friday morning, but either way, we're talking concepts soon. So lots to talk about. We'd love to have you on board. If you are new, please hit the subscribe button down below. If you did enjoy this video, hit the like button. Very curious to know your thoughts on these jerseys. If you've got a couple minutes, would love it if you went in, leave a comment. All right, talk to you soon. Adios.